Hi guys, I'm Kronos and welcome back to some more Graveyard Keeper. So, um, in this stream we are going to be kind of upgrading the camp, uh, uh, get the refugee camp a little bit more and possibly getting the rest of our zombies because uh, I've not managed to um, do that. I was going to do it off stream yesterday, last night or whatever. Um, however, I haven't had time. So, Obviously, I'm going to have to uh, do that today. But currently, we just need more faith, really. Um, and then we can get an extra couple of zombies. Uh, I think we've actually got enough uh, faith for one zombie now. <clears throat> but I can either sacrifice that and get some... Um... Oh, no, I can't. I forgot. I was looking at the prayer, uh, the prayer for faith. But we don't have enough, if I remember correctly. Because we need uh, a chapter. Which we don't have because we need notes, which means we need ink, which means we need the alchemy table. <laughs> yeah, it's one, one big cycle. So yeah, for the time being, we will, um, oh, I should have got the fair patch actually, um, for my next zombie. Oh damn it, I didn't mean to say, uh, do that, but never mind. At least it saves, I guess. Let's put, um, let's meet away, that's what I wanted to do, and the ash. Um, Need the bread for the refugee camp. Let's just go find out what this uh, new corpse is like. If uh, if it's any good and we manage to do all right with it, then um, let's just set these up over here. If we manage to do all right with it, we'll uh, turn that one into a zombie. Right. <coughs> Hopefully, anyway. It's a four. That's very nice. Let's try and do the usual stuff. So I should be able to get this up to maybe a six. As long as I don't do any surgeon mistakes. There we go. Um, see, I think it's just the zombie blood and then faith. So we'll do that. Let's uh, quickly go get my faith. On the uh, prayer for faith. Is there something in here? No. Oh, it looks like I missed one. Possibly. Mm, who knows? Well, it's tomorrow anyway. Let's. Uh, oh, where did I put my zombie juice though? I think it's. Uh, it's either in the house. Oh, it's where I just got my faith from. Or just here. There. One. It's funny how the Halloween stuff is still here. There'll probably be a patch sometime soon to uh, get rid of that. If not already, I've not checked Steam, so I don't really know. <clears throat> there we go, let's resurrect, get another zombie. Ta da! There we go. Let's, uh, let's go put this guy to work. He'll start moving logs for us pretty soon. In fact, I better put these away. Uh, 
So this guy is going to be carrying logs from the woodcutter to go back down to our little base. So I no longer have to go collect wood. Which is currently full. Sweet. There we go, look. Off he goes with my wood. I'm going to grab one as well, help him out. <laughs> Let me just, uh, I'll just quickly check Steam actually and see if there is actually a patch. There might be, I'm not sure. Um, there's a couple of updates queued for somewhere else. <coughs> there's an update for about four games actually. I'll have to have a look at them later on and see what they are. Possibility for some. Uh, update streams or something. We shall see. Right, so um, I was concentrating on the refugee camp. Let's uh, go take a look at that in a second. I'll just start some more bread cooking. There we go. Um, I don't think I need any more dough. How much dough have I got? Flour. Uh, no door. I ain't got any more door. I'll have to make some later. Let's go give them this. Um, see where we're at on food and stuff. Oh, we're at three happiness. Got no food again. <coughs> they take so much food. They're only supposed to consume 15 energy per day. It's definitely not being that. And we've got 11 water in the uh, well. I've not really been keeping track of how much water they've been using, to be honest. Um, but yeah, see, so we've got the farm stuff to build. Okay, where is the farm? Where's the farm gone? Or is it up here? Is it there? Where's my farm gone? Oh, you're joking! It didn't. It didn't record it. <laughs> We've already done that. <clears throat> I definitely uh, slept and saved um, after last last uh, last night's stream. Oh well, we're building it again. Guess it don't really matter. There we go. So that's that. So we need, uh, let's check what we need other than just happiness. So the cooking table, we just need happiness. We need maximum happiness for that. Uh, for new refugees, we just need a little bit more happiness. And peat for the bed. I forgot about that, so we need eight peat. Um, we've got plenty of that though. In fact, it looks like my crops are ready. Yes, they are. There's my pleasures, Pete. Oh, there's some hiding in the corner there. There we go. Let's uh, harvest all these. Don't need hemp. I need to try and figure out um, where I, if I can sell anything of that. I don't think we can, but um, we will see. Is this going to give me enough seeds back? No, it's not. Well, great. I've got, I've got enough for one though. Might as well do this one. So I'm slowly losing seeds on these, but it's okay. I we'll have to get some more. Eight. 
carry too much more than that if possible. Uh, equip waste, put that away. 16 carrots. We can use the hemp to get a bit more blue uh, blue tip points. Let's grab these berries. Oh, here he comes, look. Let's go check out this one. Create a contraband book. So I've got to make a cooking book for him. Cookbook. It's made in the desk. <clears throat> so we can't make any more zombies just yet. Um, but we might as well continue to grow our cemetery. That's nice. Five star. That'll do nicely. Four or five school, should I say. a few gravestones and the like, but uh, other than that, um, prayer, stop biting your leg. Yeah, let's quickly go rest. <clears throat> As time passes, uh, the happiness of the camp will increase. Um, so we'll be able to continue from there. Obviously more bread. Gotta keep sending that bread up there. We need to figure out what stuff we can cook That's uh, that gives a little bit more points. go get ready for the prayer. Uh, and I think what did I, I think I need more simple metal parts for more candelabras and stuff. Let's do that. Let's I think it was six a time. That'll give us enough for two more. Or maybe three more though. Uh, possibly. That, that's full already. The zombies have been working through the night. And here he comes again. But it's full. <laughs> Actually, I can't remember what else the candle uh, candles are. The candlesticks. What else can I sell to this dude? I need to sell bread. You can actually sell him bread to unlock the higher tier stuff. See, how come I can't unlock these? Oh, they're just too expensive. Or is that just, oh, that might be stuff that he buys, maybe, rather than sell to us. He'll, so he'll sell this casual prayer. Probably just in case we lost ours. But stuff like that would be nice. Combo prayer. Uh, prayer for faith if he's got it. There, look. I want that really. Oh, the combo prayer is actually better than faith. It's faith times one. Yeah. But either way. Obviously we're not going to unlock them unless we start selling stuff to him, but I can't really sell my bread to him because we need it. Oh, it's it is literally just simple iron parts, that's fine then. Put that one there. So we do have space for the bigger ones here, but for the time being I'll just put the smaller ones there. And that'll do. <clears throat> we don't actually need that much quality, but um, why not? 
you know. To his weekly prayer. All them people. Nice, we've got three to start with. And we should hopefully get another two. No, nope, just one. Two, there we go. <clears throat> so we've got one extra faith. So that's halfway to another zombie. And 63 copper, or bronze, whatever it is. <clears throat> Alright, let's go see... Actually, let's go grab whatever bread's left, ready. And then we'll head up to the refugee camp again. See if the happiness has increased. I really wish I could uh, hotkey that. Hang on a minute. Let's deposit that. Oh, I should have made my hemp rope while I was down there. It's fine. <coughs> it's fine though, it's fine. Two point seven seven. So it goes up by about one and a half a day. So we can get a new refugee. Well there we go, we've got enough of the bed. Put the plant bed down. It looks like it's probably more like the zombie one. Um, so it looks like you can have up to four. Okay then. So we still need more beds. Plant beds. Let's see if we have to plant anything in it. Probably. Yes, we do have to plant stuff in it. Wow. Hmm. Okay then. Looks like pumpkin gives the most energy. Hmm. We can upgrade the bed quality as well. Quality fertilizer. So this is this is kind of like the zombie beds, but not quite. <clears throat> so we need a good few more. So we need like what another 24 peat? And probably... Was it sticks or... Flinch? I can't remember. Let's, can't remember. Let's have, have a quick look. Flinch or flitch. So we need more flitch and more peat. But we're alright for now because we need the happiness to rise. Oh, I didn't drop the food off. Oh, it's great. It's fine. Let's make the flitch. A good couple, actually. As much as we can, anyway. There we go. Have I not got any more iron? Nope. So I need some iron. <laughs> so 
So we want 24 people to fill the three extra beds up. So when it becomes daytime, we probably want to go um, go get more seeds. Uh, I could do with getting more stone as well because we need to try and unlock um, the tier 2 stone merchant stuff. Let's, um, let's make a few more billets for the fight, uh, for the uh, corpses, and then probably on the next one I'll go get some. Uh, some stone to sell to the merchant. There we go. And let's head to the quarry. Actually, I don't think, no, I've not got wedges with me. I'll just have to use what I've got. <clears throat> what I'll have to do. Is there any red flowers here? There's lots of white flowers. I love a lot of white flowers. We need red ones for the cemetery. There we go. So I'll just grab what I can. Oh, and moth. Butterfly. Apparently. I'll have to try doing a little bit of fishing at some point as well to uh, give to the bishop because he wants his quality fish fillets. And that's it for the red stuff. Very energy intensive this though. Which is really annoying. There you go. Uh, is that's just showed up I'm gonna to have to uh, let that rot because I've not got enough uh, energy to do anything I 
I need these off. Try and get these finished. So making the dough doesn't cost that much energy, but making the flour does. see what we can do with it. Oh, excuse me. It's lost three percent, that's not bad. Damn it. Oh, it's another decent one. This one. <clears throat> we definitely need to start making some more gravestones and the like, though. Otherwise, we'll have nowhere to put people. I think. Sorry, my dog's being annoying. I don't know if you can hear it or not. Three that need gravestones, one that needs a skirt as it were, a barrier, no two. So five five frames, three three gravestones. Let's put this back underground. When we eventually uh, can put them down there. it needs probably peat, yeah, just one though. Oh, so it's only two at a time. And a bit of stone. Have I got stone on me? Oh yeah, I have. I was going to go sell it, wasn't I? Hmm. Oh, no, I'll leave it here then. It's fine. I'll just make some uh, more wedges and stuff so we can get some more stone. When we want to sell. <clears throat> I forgot to go visit the merchant as well. I'll have to go, not the merchant, the um, seed person. There we go. We'll grab what bread we've got and we'll head back to the refugee camp then and then um, see if we can build another plant bed. I definitely, I definitely need to buy a lot of seeds though. There we go. Happens 3.2 so we should be able to build another one. Yep. I think it had uh, Center the view on the appropriate area. There we go. Yeah, are you working the uh, the farm there? I wonder if the uh, farms are infinite once you put the seeds in there. Probably not though. But the best ones look like it's going to be pumpkins, beets, onions. Um, we shall see. So we've got a couple of quests to do for these uh, for this uh, woman and stuff as well. So we need. Oh, it's just yeah, full happy happiness. So it's just happiness we're limited on. Oh yeah, better not forget to put my bread away. I keep forgetting. He's probably here thinking it's looking empty. There you go. 
more bread. Don't say I don't give you anything. <laughs> I need some energy, but I want to go to the uh, merchant first. Seed merchant. I don't think I've got any excess stuff to sell. I can sell in these actually. I'm going to sell in my carrots. I don't need any extra because I've got loads already. Oh, yes! Lots of burial certificates. Plenty of money there. when we need it. <clears throat> to be honest, I might end up having to start buying and selling stuff to merchants, uh, wasting the money just so I can unlock further stuff. Which will be annoying, but I don't really want to. Uh, so let's buy... See, they need stuff, so they're going to need... Um... What did I say? Well, was it cab... It Cabbage, was it cabbage, onion, and pumpkin? Uh, where can I buy pumpkin seeds? Oh yeah, probably here, tier two, probably. I'd imagine. Well, let's get uh, buy these. How much is all of them? Oof, nah. Oof. I know I've got the money, but I'd rather not. Look how much cheaper it is just from those last few? Let's go for twenty. I can. I'll stretch. Oh, we need twenty-four though, don't we? Well, I'm going to have to get to 24. We've got the money. Um, and I'll sell him my carrots. Well, that gives us a profit. Where are you? Oi! Leave that hamster alone. Come on. Such an idiot is that dog. So what, what else can we... Uh, let's see how much that goes up, actually. There we go. Tomorrow we'll be able to get other stuff. So I need some more carrot seeds anyway. Let's get like an extra 10. We need some more wheat seeds as well. There we go. That freaking dog. Bear with me one second, please. instead because she's uh, being, un being a bit disobedient. Right, so uh, we've got everything else, we just need to wait until tomorrow. So I can plant I can plant the cabbage seeds at the refugee camp um, and these seeds are for us. I could probably sell some of those iron parts as well but mostly we need some uh, mostly we need some the smooth stone Let's go to the refugee camp, I think. Just we'll have a look. Happiness is 1.85. So once we get two, we can plant another one, but there's not much point, really, until we've got all the seeds. Oh no, cabbage is point... Uh, that's the worst one. So it was beet, pumpkin, and onion. <coughs> that gives the best energy. Hmm. It's Ray. Let's just yeah, we'll just we'll just plant that anyway. So do they look after it? Looks like they probably look after it. We shall see. Hopefully that will put the food directly in the tent so we don't have to uh, bring it up. But yeah. Alright, time to go back home by the sounds of it. Oh, it's actually ten bread there. <coughs> yeah, I've got the uh, I've got the zombies set up now for wood. Uh, I only made one more zombie though, so but where am I going? Not going to the cremation just yet. 
Oh, I've got no energy to even deal with this. I'll put it on here anyway. A three star. Well, we'll have to come back. I, I, I'm probably going to end up on a uh, bin that one though, burn it. Because sleeping through the night is probably going to uh, decay it a little bit too much than I would like. So I need some more wedges because I need more stone. Um, so I think it's just here for wedges, is it? No? So it must be... yeah, there we go. So we need some more billets. Let's make a good couple of them. Now that we've got a very slow but steady unlimited supply of wood. Gives us loads actually. I'll start with about that many. Here he comes, look. <laughs> there we go. That's all his wedges. I'll store the last of the billets. What did I, what am I carrying the sticks for? I can't remember. I think it were refugee camp uh, tents, I think. I'll store them. Um, I'll store my hemp as well for now. <clears throat> Put my seeds away. Right, off to the camp. Oh, I'm not off to the camp, I was off to the quarry. Well, I'll take a look anyway. 2.69. I think I'll let it max out actually so that I can um, build the kitchen. I think it will help. Look at that, it looks like it's grown already. Jesus, that was fast! <coughs> and it just disappears. What about seeds? Oh, apparently I've got enough seeds back. going there. If that returns enough seeds every time then that's actually pretty good. Hmm. Oh well, I guess I better, might as well plant it again. Yeah, if it keeps giving us a, a return with enough seeds to replant straight out, um, then that, that's a, that'll actually make it a lot easier to look after them. Because it costs way too much energy to make bread. Just way too much. Um, I think it's like a total of like a good, at least probably 13, 14 energy or something, just to make red, which is pointless because it's plus 15. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the quarry then. So, in fact, did I put any wedges in here? No, I didn't. I think the wedges will work from this inventory though, let me just see. Oh yeah, I've already got some uh, queued up, I forgot about that. Yeah, the zombie farm will definitely help. Uh, but we've got to get that alchemy mill working, so I need the smooth stone. That's the problem that we've got right now. Go on then, grab it. Oh, I haven't got enough. Yeah, I have got enough energy. That's right, I'll put it on the table. <coughs> I can't remember what I had uh, growing in my zombie farm the last time I played this. I had three zombie farms. Um on the bottom plots of my farm. But I can't remember what I was growing. Is that gonna be enough? Yeah. But ideally I probably need to keep selling uh, stone to the um, the stone guy, the stone shopkeeper guy, so that I can uh, buy the polished stone off him. And that way I won't have to wait till I can actually make polished stone. If 
Can, what do I even need for the po uh, for the polish stone thing? Oh yeah, I needed like the fifty or something for um, for that. Uh, so we need to get to fifty blue. So it's either a little bit of faith and then an, a, a body part um, or lots of hemp. So uh, yeah, it's probably like more likely that we'll get there first for a little bit of faith. So that we can uh, research. Oh, in fact, I've already got like five or six faith because I've, uh, I've just done a ceremony. So uh, I might actually be able to get that now. We'll go and take a look in a minute. Ah, pants full. Okay then. Let's um, cut these up and then we can sell them. I've got farming points that I've got. I've actually got more farming points now than labour. It's kind of funny. Right, one more sleep. Might as well go to the uh, merchant. That farmer will sell us the better stuff as well now. <clears throat> I might as well go to the tavern keeper as well and sell all those um, certificates. Energy does it take? 15. I'm assuming we've got 100 out, uh, as a maximum. Um, but that'll do for now. Right, so let's. Um, mm, yeah, let's go straight to the dead horse. So let's just uh, our certificates first. Fifteen silver. The price don't go down, does it? No, it don't. It's set. That's perfect. Um, is there anything we need to give to what's his face? I think he wants some wine. Um, I'll just get that anyway. Let's have a look. Yeah, this skull. He wants a bottle of wine. I'm not sure what wine though. I think it's just like a, a, sta uh, a standard bronze or silver wine. So it's either that one or that one, maybe? I'm not sure. Mm. I'll leave it for now, it's fine. Let's uh, let's go to the stone, stone merchant, and then um, probably the blacksmith as well. Maybe even that dig guy as well, get some more hemp. Is it definitely only uh, swords and candles that you can use hemp brew up on? I might have to uh, just do a look, check the wiki out and see what it says. Is this going to come anywhere near close to unlocking him? Nah. See, what I could do is I could technically buy it back, but look how much it <laughs> look how much it cost. How much did I just sell him? Like a stack and a bit. So basically, yeah, well that's. I'd rather sell him the stone than anything else. Oh, what's this? I'll cancel off it, yeah. So we'll leave that. Let's go to the blacksmith, sell him some more metal parts. I uh, can't understand what you're saying there, Slazic. If that's how I say your name, probably not. Sell him some metal parts, so we can slowly work. Oh, we can sell him the coal as well. Coal's really easy to uh, to do as well. Get I get like stacks of twenty at a time. That's actually a pretty decent way to do it, actually. Um, 
In that case, I'll keep my metal parts. I'll just sell him that. I know it's not going to give me much, but uh, yeah, I'll come back with uh, more coal at some point. Let's go talk to Dig. So yeah, I'm assuming Dig will probably buy honey at some point as well, since we had to give him some honey earlier on. Maybe not. He buys firewood though, by the looks of it. I'll buy all his hemp seeds though. Um, is, it, is there anybody else I need to speak to? No, not really. Uh, what energy have we got left? Plenty. Let's go... Let's see what kind of... Um, Stuff we can make. Ooh, pointy. Oh, yeah, we better go to the seed merchant actually. That's a good point. Um, oh, we can actually make a tiny bit more door without making the flower first. That didn't cost too much. Cost a bit of it a little bit though. So that's all, how much energy is it? So it's eight for that. So yes, twelve energy. So you only get a net gain of three energy by making bread. So it's not brilliant, really. But oh well. So let's uh, let's go buy some higher tier seeds. The seed merchant first. And we'll make all that hemp. See what kind of blue points we can get up to. Uh, research some body parts as well. So we'll be able to unlock the smooth stone anyway, I'd imagine. This is still here, it's getting pretty late. There we go. So pumpkin. I want the pumpkin seeds that really. We need twenty-four. Oh onion, I want onion as well, but I'll take the bronze. It's only got three is, is, is it's only got three. Jesus, I'm gonna have to keep coming back here. Cause that's not even enough to uh, put one down. What about pumpkin seeds though? Has he got any pumpkin seeds? Oh, I've got tier 3 as well. Oh, there you go. That's silver stat though. Guess it don't matter though. I don't think he sells the bronze stuff. And beets. It will beets as well, won't it? I'll take all them. Oh, there's pumpkin, yeah, there's pumpkin seeds there as well. Oh, that's just in it. So, yeah, three pumpkin seeds. Then the silver ones are there. Only one, though. So, I'll have to keep coming back to him to buy these seeds until we've got enough. That's kind of annoying, but... Oh, well. It might be, though, because we've only just unlocked it, though. So, his stock's pretty low. Maybe. Hmm. So I don't need a teleport. Oh look at that. There's another coal pot there. Can we do it from here? No we can't. That would have been funny. Where's that on the map? I don't think we can even go there. No, it's down here. So the only way to get there would be to go through the gate to the town and walk all the way around. But I don't think that's even possible. That's probably there more for uh, aesthetics than anything else, even though it is functional. So I've always wondered if you can investigate that there. Uh, I'll keep picking up these red plants as well, because we want them for the uh, church. Oh, that's a yellow. Oh, is it? No, it is red. Is it? Yeah. Can't do 
burn down the free berries though. Okay, red flowers, berries. Um, so I might as well keep the seeds here for now. Especially my hemp ones anyway. Um, yeah, that'll do. Right, so I'll replant them once we can harvest everything. Oh, actually, it looks like we might be able to. Yep, apparently. I don't think I'll have enough energy for all of them, though. So we'll sleep, check on his crops, and then we'll go head back to the um, refugee camp, see what the uh, happiness is like. See how many uh, fields we can technically do. This one. This one just needs the seeds. Uh, which one is it there? We can do one more. There we go, that one's slowly growing. There we are. I'm not going to plant more than three for these at the moment. Until later on, maybe. bunch more hemp. Where did I put my last hemp? Did I leave it downstairs? I can't remember. And I need... S yeah, 16... Oop, damn it. 16 peat is the much, as, as much as I need, I think. Put it in this chest in there. Yes. Got all that hemp probe. Let me just put it into wiki. I know you said we can't sell it, but I'm going to have a quick look and uh, see what it says. If uh, if at all. Let's see if it can be uh, sold anywhere or used on anything else. So you can study it, but obviously you can only do that once. And then it's used on swords and of candles one at a time. So yeah, I guess that really is it. Hmm. It's a shame. Yeah, so you definitely can't sell them. So he was right there. <laughs> oh well, never mind. Um, yeah, let's go make the hemp pro and um, quite possibly research something to get the blue points we need for smooth stone. So 
So I don't have any in here as well, do I? No, I don't. That's fine. Uh, which one is it under? So this one must be this one. No, nope, that's a bucket of blood. There we go. So yeah, we can use it for this, but that's about it. So we need lots of beeswax and then fat. But we definitely won't be using much of it, so we probably uh, will have to end up just destroying it most for the most part. 22, Jesus. We might actually have enough blue points to unlock, uh, well, almost enough to unlock it anyway. I'm not going to have the energy though, by the looks of it. I've got a, few, a little bit there. Still probably not going to be enough. No, but look at that, there's a ridiculous amount of hemp rope. And there's absolutely nothing we can do with it, so we're probably going to end up having to destroy it. Which is a bit of a shame, really. See, so we do have the faith, but I can't research it because, uh, unfortunately, I've got no energy. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'm going to have a bit of bread. I know it's technically for that village, but oh well. Yeah, but I think uh, I'm just going to end up destroying most of it. Because uh, we can't sell it and we can't do anything with it. And I've got crap tons of hemp rope everywhere. So I'll just keep a little bit of it around here or there. Um, like what can we research? We need to research more like crosses and things. I'll take all of these actually. Um, research that. Well, I can research stuff like the skulls and stuff as well. Uh, yeah, this one. But nine science, that should be enough. Do the skull first. Oh, that's only one fifth. So some require one, some require two. Uh, I'm gonna make cake first. Well, I haven't quite researched that. Let's go. Let's go find out what it, it, it takes to make a cake. Because I, I want the extra points when we're researching stuff. Cake. Is the cake made? Is it in here? Oh, I'm not even going to be able to see, am I? I got the recipe for the cake. Well, crap. Uh, I'll just look at it online instead then. So, cake. It's uh, pastry dough, honey, berry, and some fuel. So that's fairly easy, actually. I've got a couple, of, couple of honey already. That means I'd have to wait for this. What am I? What am I at? Ah, oh, forty-eight, which is too short. Mm. Can I get any more hemp? No, not, not for a while. Well, I guess I'll just rest for now. Uh, put them away. We'll get some more faith anyway in the morning. <coughs> in fact, I better get some more water as well for all that dough that we've been cooking. I don't know specifically how much more points I'll get for using um, the circumvent. Uh, buff from cake, but it's worth having. Actually, if I will do it, actually, now I might as well finish now. Did I leave some in here? I left five in there anyway. It's, um, I wonder if they'd use it if you just put the bucket in there rather than the water. No idea. 
Don't cost us anything anyway, so. There we go. Hundred water. left before we can cook his cake anyway. So we need pastry dough. Is that the same as dough? No, it's that. Oh, you need milk. One milk and an egg. So we'll have to go to town to get them. If you want the circumvent. Um, right. Let's uh, let's go do his church ceremony first. And we'll head to town. Some milk and egg. Um, I don't think there's anything else we can like take to town or anything either. Nah. Anyway, we'll take the casual prayer. Start that little bit of hemp rope in here. I don't know if it's too early, but we'll have a go. Nope, it's fine. Nice, we've got three to start with. Sweet. Another two. So that's five again, that's nice, that's good. That's enough for another zombie, that. Obviously, I'll probably do research first. <laughs> as much as I'd like more zombies. Um, uh, let's um, yeah, let's go to the refugee camp first. Seven happiness. I can put the kitchen down now. Building that there. So this woman can uh, shut up. <laughs> Just a box and a barrel with some planks on it. There you go, I made it. But so different from my luxury kitchen, yeah, no crap. Improve it. So what have I got to make now? Improve the kitchen, it says. We've got an, uh, an extra maximum happiness though. So what would it need to improve it? More planks and nails, basically. That's not too hard. Farm. Yeah? Did he? Oh yeah, he harvests it himself, doesn't he? Looks like we do get some, enough seeds back every time, that's perfect. That means I won't have to bring as much food with me. It's just a case of coming back to check on them often enough. Yeah! There you go, there's some more food. And more water. The world's got 21. I don't think they've actually used more water than I put in there actually, so that's uh so it looks like it's gonna get a lot easier to look after them as time goes on. Um where was I gonna go to oh yeah, go to the town to um get some milk. It's is it that woman up there? I think it's that see if, I know where the, uh, the eggs are to the right and I think the milk is this lady up here. Yep. So it was a jug of milk. Let's get. I've got enough honey for three, so let's let's get enough for three. <clears throat> and then the egg person is down this road. Well, I say person. It's just a basket, but yeah. There we go. Will do nicely. So 
we still need to wait for four more. Hmm. I guess we'll go bu uh, burn some corpses. Well, a corpse. Um, yeah, billets. That's it. That's what I'll, I'll try to think then what I, what, what I needed. Oh, we need some planks as well, don't we, for the kitchen. So I'll do some of them as well. Um, I know that's going to be faster, but I'll just do the planks here. How much was it? Was it six? Yeah, I'll do six. Six is usually the number. Like I might not have enough energy to do uh, do the burnt cops burning anyway. <coughs> Start my uh, looking eggs. Um, guess we'll just do what I can. Get the blood and get the fat and the skin, flesh. Is there anything else I use the blood for actually? I know we need it for the bucket of blood, but that's about it. I'll use the fats for the candles. I need more energy. I'm gonna have to add my bread, at least some of it anyway. Take the flesh. Skin. That will do. How many of these can put us down? All four by the looks of it. Nice. Have enough for one more. Gonna bring it all to the uh, kitchen. So I wish you could repair stuff like this as well. Eventually, like up upgrade the uh, the garden properly. Because as far as I know, you can't repair stuff like that. It's always broken. It'd be nice if you could kind of like beautify your your your, uh, your house. We don't need that much peat. It's just 16, yeah. Here he comes with another stone. I mean, hog. Ooh, nice. So we should be able to make the cake in the morning. So, cake, there, uh, circumspect, it's also 95 energy as well, which is awesome, um, so we just need the pastry dough, which is flour, so we need another flour, hello Matt, how are you doing? <laughs> Another two of them as well. Queue it up. Oh, I need some more flour still. There we go. Let's uh, start baking cake. So it 
takes 45 seconds of time. That's not long actually. Pretty quick. So the ash can stay there. The salt the pastry dough. The rest can go up under underground. So let's um, as soon as that one of the cakes is done, we can start doing some research as well. And I think that's it. Yep. Right. Let's uh, go visit the refugee camp again. See. Um, See how we're progressing there. 2.68 happiness. The farm's finished again. That is actually really good. It's really fast. So it looks like we never really get extra back. Like extra, extra. But we get enough to replant. Which is fine. So they're eating cabbage now. I'm gonna take a uh, take my bread back. <laughs> At least a good bit of it. If they can survive on the veg that I'm growing, then that's perfect. And uh, let's put down the. Do I make another refugee? Actually, I think I can do both anyway. Let's do this one. Oh no, I can't. I ain't got enough for happiness. There we go. Yeah, more happiness needed. I don't know why they need happiness though, so you can actually build uh, a crop bed. There we go. So we need more seeds, really. See, I could actually get them to grow wheat for me. Um, I'm assuming she can possibly cook it eventually, but it doesn't give me an option for that <laughs> now. Hmm. Well, we'll keep an eye on it anyway. Um, did I use my nails on something? Was the nails used on the crop? I need them for the kitchen. No? So, oh yeah, so I just need 18 nails, and it's actually 12 planks. So we need some more planks. Oh, there's my uh, cake. There's one, one left to come. So I need 12 planks. Another 6 planks. Here comes my FedEx delivery. Unfortunately, I'm uh, apparently out, even though I'm in all day. <laughs> <coughs> and then, um, get my switch. Here comes another zombie, uh, another uh, potential zombie. That's probably just going to get thrown on the fire. Nails. How many nails did I need? Was it like, 18? I'll need another one. No energy. Eat a bit of bread. There we go. There's that. Right, so we will um, carry on making bread on our cat. Let's bake, bake my mushrooms then, why not? <clears throat> we'll rest and we'll go do some research uh, so that we can unlock some more tech as the uh, as we wait for the happiness to rise in the refugee camp I'll go buy some more seeds as well from the farmer I'm not going to hotkey that because I don't want to eat it by accident. It actually gives a crap ton of energy as well. 
Um, maybe I should make something else first. Oh, let's go sort out the uh, corpse first. And then when my energy gets a bit lower, I'll use it then, just to save it. So it's not a complete waste. I'm probably going to be burning this one. It's already at 95%. Oh, it's a good one as well. Mm. Well, let's just hurry up. We might be able to, uh, might be able to bury it. As long as we don't make any uh, surgery mistakes. It's going good. Um, yeah, I don't need to take anything else out if I'm burying it. And it's chucking it down. They were chucking it down yesterday like crazy. I mean, Matt will know all about that because it's flooding over at Skipton. <laughs> Alright, so where shall I put the grave for this one? Down here? I'll fill this pot up down here. That one's going to have to move. Actually, no, that one can stay. That one needs to move though. So that I can put the flower beds in the middle and stuff, or at least the grass or whatever. go. So it didn't decompose too much. Um, but we will need to start decorating these. But ideally I want to decorate in stone. That's what I'm waiting for. Um, so we shall see. Let's, now let's go back downstairs then. Got 63 bronze or copper or whatever it is. So what is it? It's silver. So bronze and then silver. Go. Not really use much points though. It's fine, I'm not even bothered. I can always make more cake. There we go. Two minutes to do research. I don't even know how many I've got. It was meant to be 20, but we should get more with that circumvent. Um, right. Let's so skin. So we're at 69. So we only got an extra one point, was it? So it's not brilliant. So I guess it's kind of pointless, really. Um, the cake. It's obviously something. Oh, that's three. I wonder why some things are just one and some are three and so on and so forth. Fluid, so we can decompose that one. Wow, Jesus, that were a big one. That's why it costs more. Okay, what about the hat? That's three as well, so that'll be a big boost. Big, big boost. Essence. Nice. Yep. Oh, we've got no more science. We need some more paper. Got plenty of paper though. We'll do take it down to 40 mark. There we go. Let's do the flesh. So this will only be a little boost. We're going to be able to unlock lots of stuff now. And uh, what? And then wooden grave. That's the last of his faith. There we go. 234. So we definitely need polished stone. There we go. Marble would be nice, but uh, we don't really need it just yet. Zombie quarrying. I'll, I'll get that now as well. Even though I can't, I don't, can't do the zombies just yet. Zombie quarrying 2. Oh, yeah. I can't unlock it. Oh, I need something above it. I need the marble. Oh, yeah, because it's the marble mining it. Never mind, I'll leave that for now then. And then zombie mining. For the ore mine left. Zombie stone quarry, right. Zombie ore mine left. Oh, I think that's the metal mine. Yeah, I'll be unlocking that as well. Uh, what else do we need? 
It's tricks of the trade. How to deal with wood. Circular saws are more productive. Nah, I don't really need that stuff yet. Right, what else can we unlock? The blacksmith will give us extra nails. Um, lantern network. I'd love to do that. Handle number two. Um, better tools. I don't even take blue points actually, so we could actually do that. Well, once we've done that. Yeah, let's get anvil two and we'll go for better tools. What's that? A water pump? Nah. That's more just energy saving kind of thing, that ain't it? It's just, yeah. Then we'll get the pickaxe. So we're very low on red points now. Um, yeah, so if we want better swords and stuff, we'll need more points. Farming. Let's look at farming. We've got the beekeeping. So we'll probably we'll probably want to do bees pretty soon, especially if I'm going to start making cake. Oh, zombie gardening. There we go. We want that. So we'll get to normal gardening. You aren't afraid of getting your hands that you can select good seeds and harvest a better crop. Does that mean I'll get more seeds back as well, though? We'll see. And then do zombie farming. Uh, no, we don't need, really need brewing just yet. Fertilizers. When we start doing the zombie stuff, we probably will need those, but not just yet. A zombie vineyard. We've not been doing the great farming just yet. But that's something we probably want to get into, because wine is good energy. What else can we do? Book writing, we definitely need stuff like that. Interesting stories. We will need stories. Random text generator. Um, the bookshelf, desk 2, paper reduction. Does that mean we'll get more paper per like skin and stuff? Um, Sure. So what do we? So we use the stories, don't we, for um, like the chapters and things? Yeah. So we are going to need a consistent source of stories. Yeah. So let's get that. We'll get stories. Create stories. Um. Having a zombie do it would be nice. I guess we don't need it straight away. Maybe upgrade the church a little bit. Oh, gentle butcher, I definitely want that actually. Um, I'm going for the. I've been waiting for the fridge pallet as well, so I'll work, work my way to that. Can I get it actually? Here's the embalming mortuary rack. What do we need? What do we need for that? Oh, the embalming stuff. A church workbench. We got enough point. Yeah, we have enough points. Let's uh, unlock the fridge pallet. It's a lot of stuff. There we go. So we can have a double pallet, but uh, it's not refrigerated. Is the fridge pallet double already? Isn't it? Yes. Zombie alchemy workbench. That'd be nice. Distillation. What's the distillation used for? How can we work bench two? I guess I'll save the rest of my points. Or maybe upgrade the church. Oh flyers, we need flyers for the um the, the bishop. We'll unlock that one. Prayer for donations. Combo prayer. The combo prayer would be nice. I don't know how much it'd cost to make though. The confessional's a big upgrade. Better gravestones would be nice, but I need more red. Yeah, I'll wait for that. I'll unlock that. <clears throat> the confessional bit will be nice. Um, 
We can earn some more, and we can do some more studying and stuff. Right, uh, let me think. What can we do? Can we actually grind any of this stuff down already? We can. So what does it actually turn into? I know it shows a white paste. But what is it? Life solution. Oh, I think that might be the other thing that we need. Yeah. So that's that's what you can get. Uh, I think we, that, the one that we can get from like just crop waste. Oh no, that's health powder. So what's life solution? I think that's life solution as well. By the looks of it, it's white powder. So it might, so it might be health and li uh, and maybe the uh, life stuff then. I think I might have to make more storage. You know, store my cake here. So that decomposes into stuff as well. So how come I couldn't actually do that? It's probably in the alchemy mill, isn't it? Yeah, probably. I'll just store it for now. Um, that can go back upstairs. Skin, that doesn't do anything. I'll just get rid of that. Story. The wooden grave fence can just go on somewhere upstairs. Uh, let's get rid of that. Uh, put it on this guy here, why not? Ta da! We'll check out his new zombie. Uh, corpse. Keep calling them zombies. And then we can start building all the new workbenches and stuff. Well, that's that's going to be a, a, a six, a six a white skull. If I don't make any mistakes. Nice. I'll have that. New addition to my uh, graveyard. Advanced grave digger. Okay then. Can we repair the wall yet? I didn't even look. No. But we can do flower beds. Which can only go in specific spots anyway. How many can I place down? Have I got enough? I have. Sweet. We're now at 32 quality. That should help with the amount of visitors that we get. Hopefully. So, I need more red energy, um, and then we can start making stuff like the polished brick, let's use this one. So we need 30 red, oh we need polishing paste though, or a chisel. What do we need for polishing paste though? I can make a chisel easy enough though. Where is it? Oh there. River stands oil and then ceramic balls. How can you make oil in the hand mixer? No idea. Let's just make chisels. It's easier. Costs a lot of energy though. <clears throat> See, how many polished stone do I need for that um, thing downstairs? I can't remember. It's going to be at least one anyway, I know that much. Possibly two. Oh, I'm out of energy. Let's rest. When it's uh, daytime, we will... Um, Go to the seed merchant. 
I'd imagine the refugee camp happiness will be high enough as well to uh, do a bit more upgrading. I might as well make two more of these and then I'll have my 30 red points for all my gravestones. Oh, opened it up too quickly. There we go. Oh, it's 34. Anyway, let's make this stone gravestones. Um, so do I need upgraded thing or... No, I don't. So we can get the stone grave and the, and the actual gravestones, and that's just normal rock. So I'll have to go get some more rock. Um, yeah. More rock. But anyway, let's go to the refugee camp first. I'll, I'll sort that out when I get back, actually. Oh, let's go get seeds first, actually. Just in case we can plant some more stuff. Berries, I'll have them. Yep, here he comes. <laughs> well, considering I'm busy, uh, that one will probably go to the cremation. Yeah, the seed amounts do go up, but I just have to wait a little bit longer. So that's fine. I'm going to get all of them. Um, pumpkin, all of them. That's oh, silver onion. I'm not even bothered about stuff like lentils and things. Um, wheat, cabbage. Do I need more? Oh, I need beet. I'll get that. Yeah, I'll stockpile a little bit more. I'll get about another 10 again. Just so eventually I'll be able to do a good... Eh? Oh, don't tell me I've got not got enough space ever. God damn! Only got enough for two. Cancel that, mate. Um... I'll just try this peat. I'm surprised they don't buy that actually. And I guess I'll leave these two. So I need beet, the onion, and the pumpkin. That'll do. Right. Um, I'll teleport back to the house first. Because I've not dropped everything off. I'll drop a good stack of these off, so I don't need to be carrying them all around with me. I just need a little bit. Mm, and then. The stone can stay. Oh, I need some more storage. See, look at all these stupid emeralds, man. I'll uh, I'm gonna keep some, the rest can get sold. Right, the, the polished brick is for downstairs, so I'll put this stone away. And we'll destroy all this hemp. Or the rope, anyway. There we go. Uh, put my seeds away. If I have 24, then obviously I'll be able to take them with me. I don't think I have yet. Nah. Beats 18. Nah. We'll slowly get there, though. Alright. Oh, it's not cooled down yet. I guess I'll go put my uh, blood and fat downstairs. 
Oh yeah, I'll have to go see what we need for the uh, the beehives and stuff as well. And let's see what we need for the alchemy bench down here, the alchemy mill. Uh, it was two. So we can build that now. Right, what fit there? I'll put it up here then next to this one. So what is there anything else that we need to build up here? Maybe the maybe the alchemy rack? A scroll shelf? Possibly. Just to free up storage. Not just yet though, I guess, because uh, I'll need to make more nails. So I should now be able to mill apparently nothing. What? Have I got to study it before it'll let me mill it? It's probably the case, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it's the mill that I need uh, for the health powder. It is. So I'm probably going to have to research it first. How much faith do I need then to research crop waste? One. Damn it! Oh well. Let's head to the refugee camp. Even though it's like the middle of the night. More cabbage. See, it's got one less seed there. So eventually I probably will have to top it up, we'll, we'll see. Apparently some stuff on my wish list is uh, on sale. <laughs> it's always nice. We've got four happiness. Oh, she needs eight for that, so we haven't even got a high enough maximum anyway. Oh, I need the peat. Actually, it can do, yeah. I just need all the way up there. Let's check how, th how they're doing on food and water. Is it sustaining them on just cabbage? Mm, maybe not quite. I think it's probably because I've missed actually giving them some for a while. I'll tell you what, you can have my baked mushrooms. Spoil them. Uh, let's go to that coal mine. I can sell them to the uh, blacksmith. I don't think there's one on this side. <coughs> nope. It's on the other side of the river. Oh, what, what kind of fish do you get here? Oh, I've got no bait on me, have I? Oh, you can fish without bait, can't you? No bait. I didn't click anything yet. Oh, you got to hold it there. There we go. I don't know. It's been a while since I've done it, so I'm not really sure. If we can get something without bait. Oh, pushed it too early. So that's how you reel it in. So you can get 100% there. I think you got to hold the key down. Check for some ripples. There we go. Nothing. It definitely rippled. So you hold it. Yeah, you hold it. Has it got to like go down a bit further? So that's just a nibble. a nibble. Two energy it costs. Is that it? There we go. Oh, nah. There. Ugh, this is why nobody likes fishing on games. Why am I pushing the wrong key maybe? Oh, 
Oh, there you go. I remember this bit, it's annoying. What's this then? A bream. Silver quality. I don't know what we can make quality fish fillets out of though. Um, I'll leave that one for now, but that's obviously what we can catch there. I'll have to see if I can make the fish fillets out of that. The quality fish meat or whatever it's called that the bishop wants. Go. That's so much easier than making simple iron parts to sell. anyway. So let's have a look. Fish fillets. It is a bream as well. So I might be able to get silver grade. Made industrious as well. So we probably do need to catch another few. Fate gets the legendary cheese helmet and is able to buy high grade gear off the bat. Eh? <laughs> what? What's fate? Quality fish fillet. Silver. See I think he, he only wants bronze. Where is, where's the bishop? There. Four quality fish fillets, but it doesn't say any kind of rank. Let's start off now. Oh, it's an old game, right. Diablo esque. I love the original Diablo, and I've played Diablo 3 a good bit as well, uh, but I wasn't as impressed by it, should I say? <coughs> Right, let's go to the blacksmith, sell that. One out of a hundred catches from fishing. Right. That sounds like something I'd totally be into. <laughs> yeah. I'm constantly grinding uh, fishing just so I can get some uh, decent equipment. Let's see how much you give me for all this. Oh wow, the uh, the amount of money goes down a lot though. But look at that! That is some for, for for like a couple of minutes work. That is a lot of silver. That is awesome. And that's a good bit up there as well. See, I need that cauldron as well. Actually, I totally forgot about that. Uh, I'm gonna go red dig of his um, hemp seeds again. I'm surprised he doesn't sell more than that. Another eight. Thank you very much. Actually, no, there. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll walk back. Let's go to that seed merchant again. Right, so he's only got two more beet seeds. I'm gonna grab them anyway. Um, onion. Okay, I know it's more expensive when they're nearly out, but it's fine. And uh, yeah, get 
a few more of these like I was going to do before. So for 10, same with carrots. So actually, yeah, I'll get some extra cabbage as well to put in the tent just in case they uh, don't get enough yield. Back up there. Got 5.53. Still got plenty of cabbage. Alright, so they need cabbage. There we go. I don't think I've got enough seeds yet to uh, plant one of the others. Let's cool down. What have we got enough to do? Oh yeah, if I get the peat, I can put another bed down and another refugee. See, if I get more refugees, will the happiness go up faster? I'm not sure. Hmm. No, I think I'm going to wait for the kitchen. Just like I need to wait for that cooldown. <laughs> there we go. Do us farming here, and then we'll probably start making stone um, gravestones and things. Finally, get those points up and running. So I didn't get enough hemp seeds back there. I'm not getting very many seeds. I should be getting higher yields than normal uh, due to that perk. So we could probably plant two more. I need to peat this one. And hemp. Which one's the hemp? One. There we go, we've nearly got a full field of hemp. Definitely never going to be short on green energy, green tech points. More seeds away. Uh, carrots, crop waste, pumpkin seeds. Uh, the wheat can go in the house. So, how many have we got a stack of 24 of anything yet? Um, no, not quite. We're close to it with beets. So I could start using these to fish. And butterflies and moths. But not just yet. Um, in fact, we might as well actually. I'll take them and the stack of them. We'll go back up to the refugee camp and uh, fish there to get the quality fish fillets for the. Uh, the bishop. What else does he want? 20 at the church. Oh, we, we ain't got that yet. But we've got 30 at the graveyard. Uh, let's deposit the um, wheat and the hemp downstairs. the space. Let's make the rope then. I want. That is the right one, won't it? So where is it? Oh there. I 
Another 70 rope. amount of rope unfortunately I think I can store that one car yeah right uh, I might as well rest first and then we'll try and get at least another three bream uh, ready to uh, give to the bishop Oh, I need my 8 peat, don't I? I'll take that with me as well. For the rest of the farm. Other farm bed. There we go. I still need another 6 planks as well. For her kitchen. camp. So they're at 6.65. <clears throat> at least we get a bit of blue points every time we do it. That's the only reason why I'm doing it. Outer Worlds. After another cause I've been playing a lot. Right. Yeah, it can be difficult sometimes to meet the times, especially if um, you, you get like a little distracted for whatever reason or something. Life gets in the way, as it were. Come yeah, on. Nope, nope that didn't count. God damn it. But yeah, every now and again, sometimes I do have to kind of take a day off here or there, but. Uh, for the most part, um, I get one out pretty much every day, or stream every day anyway. I don't really have time to edit videos, so that's why I mostly just stream at the moment. Oh, come on. I don't know, I'm definitely pushing the right one. So that cost me a point. So yeah, I might not be pushing it fast enough, maybe. Right. There we go. Another silver bream. Must be a good spot, this. Streaming on other sites? Mm. I don't know. I mean, I know you can do multi-stream um, using stuff like uh, Streamlabs Prime or uh, Restream, it's called, I think. Um, and it probably will help with viewership initially, maybe. Um, however, stuff like Twitch and things is a bit iffy with how you multi-stream. So they like you to um, they like you to stream only on their platform. Um, so especially if you get partner with them, which is pretty easy to do actually, because um, you only need like 50 followers or something. Um, so once you've got partner, you can only upload your videos there. 
And I think you've got to wait a minimum of 24 hours before you can put it anywhere else. So you can't multi-stream once you've done that. <clears throat> so yeah, for the time being, um, personally, I, I just prefer to use YouTube because uh, later on, I mean, initially it's hard to get set up and grow an audience. Um, but further down the line, I don't know, further down the line, it'll be better. It'll be a better platform. They do need to upgrade a few things though and give a, a few more features and options. That better be count apparently. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't uh, with this fishing lot. It's a bit awkward. There we go. Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. So I've actually got two silver. Two. S oh no. Yeah. So I've got three silver in total now and one bronze. I'm going to need, I think, four of just one. But yeah, there's, there's typically a catch to pretty much any service. Because naturally they want you to use their platform rather than anybody else's. Um, see, I think Facebook streaming, although they're still very new as well, um, damn it, is um, a good platform as well for growing your audience. It's obviously a crap ton of people use Facebook. Um, and then Twitch is more or less the same. Um, where obviously... God damn. Must be pushing, uh, pushing the... The key wrong, I don't know. But um, yeah, Twitch is pretty much the same. Obviously, that's got a larger viewer base on actual live stream videos because uh, that's why everybody goes for them. So um, it's easier to um, grow on either Facebook or Twitch. But later on, uh, YouTube has the best potential. Um, in terms of like if you want to make it your career as it were. Nice, that's another uh, bronze. So yeah, so it might be harder to start. I mean what what some people have done is they've started on either Facebook or Twitch and then once they've got a bit of a following uh, what they'll do is they'll basically just obviously declare to their followers that uh, they're going to start streaming over on the other platform and try and get everybody to follow them over but uh, not everybody will because not everybody you know wants to have a YouTube account or what it, or for whatever reason that kind of thing but it's a good it's a good way to start though yeah See, I'm on a few Facebook groups and things, but um, to be honest, they've not really helped at all. Not really. So, I think uh, just get, keeping a consistent schedule, um, whether it be one video a week like yourself, or every day, it don't, it don't really matter. Um, as long as it's somewhat consistent, obviously your supporters um, get to know when you when you're actually going to stream and stuff, and uh, that just helps you helps you grow your play a bit, your uh, your viewership, your uh, supporters. <laughs> yeah, uh, it makes it sound like quite a lot a long way to go, doesn't it? When you say it like that. But yeah, I'm not. See, I'm I'm doing all right on the watch hours, for the most part. Um, I do get a lot of watch mates. However, um, obviously the 1,000 subscribers is probably going to take me the longest. I need one more of either a power playlist. Yeah, I try to, uh, as best I can anyway, I try to stream 
every day. Um, and generally I, I try to mix my games up a little bit here or there, just in case somebody don't like one particular game. Um, I, I haven't always done that though, it depends on what games I've got available to play really. If I've only got one game to play I can't really stream more than one game. Oh, not enough energy. Let's eat a bit of bread. I need just one more. Preferably bronze, really. I don't want to give him my silver fish. Come on. There we go. Right, too much. Right. this one a bronze there we go that'll do that's all my fishing for now anyway hopefully I don't have to come back and do more fishing all right yeah put them in here um guess I'll put my moths and uh, maggots and stuff in here for when I next go fishing So yeah, bronze ones, so we want four bronze ones. Looks like I can't queue it up, I've just got to keep pushing it. There we go, so we've got the uh, bishop's food. For the... Uh, for, for the ceremony tomorrow. <clears throat> but yeah, personally, ideally, I want to try and collaborate with obviously bigger YouTubers. Because um, that would be a tremendous boost. I don't necessarily want to leech off them. I don't want to feel like a leech, as it were. But obviously, joining one of their streams for a multiplayer stream of some sort. Um, would be ideal because that way um, the likelihood is that you know if they if they like my like personality I guess you could say while I'm on their stream the likelihood is they'll also come and join me uh, on my platform on my channel um, so that that would be best case scenario especially if they're quite big youtubers anyway Make some more planks as well. I'm just going to do them here. There we go. Uh, I'm just going to rest a little bit so it's daytime and then we'll go do his prayers. But yeah, it'd be, it'd be nice to find some uh, bigger YouTubers that w would be willing to do a collaboration on something or, or, or another. Um, so that would probably drastically shorten the amount of time it takes to. Uh, grow. Um, yeah, we'll go underground so I can drop that that um, hemp and stuff off. Well, one hemp because that's all I've got. Oh, three. Never mind. I've got three. Ah, I didn't bring my uh, thing up. Let's just go talk to the bishop real quick. Give him his fish. So it is bronze that we needed to give him anyway. And the graveyard. Now we need 20 for the church. Um, nah, I don't need any more of that. I'm selling my bread for it to him. Let's try and upgrade that. Ah, oh, it didn't go up much, did it? Well, I can keep selling bread to him, I suppose. Here or there, if I'm not going to eat it myself, that is. Did I unlock anything else? I can't remember if I did. 
Uh, no, I didn't. Let's see how many people show up this time. Hmm, about the same, probably. Oh, three people liked it now. more so it's about five each time 100% chance but we're getting five a time that's not too bad though right let's uh, study um, crop waste so we can make the health powder Doesn't say what powder. Oh, we've even got a story from that. So, oh, it's in. I think. Is it in the alchemy mill or is it in here? Yeah, alchemy mill, definitely. That's why we were trying to get one for so long. There we go. Health powder. Right, so what do we actually need then for the zombie mix? Um, it's definitely going to be health powder and it's got to be something else. Uh, blood. It's just health powder and blood. That, okay, that's actually really easy. We've got loads of blood as well. So, let's um, make a bunch more health powder. And uh, we can get quite a lot of zombie juice ready for our little zombie army. Making everything for us. And then the only restriction would be faith. Eight. Let's go for ten, maybe. There we go. So then it's uh, health powder and blood. I think it saves the recipe as well. Zombie juice. There you go. Look. So let's make another nine. So zombie juice is really cheap. Just a bit of crop waste and some blood. Oh, we're gonna have enough energy. Damn it. We've got nothing to eat ever. Nope. Apart from uh, my cake, which I don't really want to eat. Hmm. Nah. It's fine. Store that, store that, that. My stories. I definitely could do with the shelf to put my paper stuff in. Um, See, so where's the rest of my zombies? The juice is upstairs. Uh, Streamlabs is basically the same as OBS if you use OBS. That's just what it's called. It's called Streamlabs OBS. It kind of like tries to streamline. Well, maybe not streamline, but it makes. Um, makes it easier uh, to do certain things um, like for instance um, well I'm having trouble with some of it to be honest but basically you should, you, you're meant to be able to put like obviously stuff like your notifications so like when somebody subscribes things like that you use a widget um, and basically an app but a widget it's called um, in the program itself and um, it automatically links it to your account so when somebody subscribes if their uh, subscriber status is public it, it'll show up on screen that kind of thing um, you can also have chat overlays which I'm meant to have basically when my stream starts and when it ends on those screens it's meant to have a chat overlay so the chat shows up on screen but for some reason it's very finicky right now and I, I've only managed to get it to work a couple of times it, it's very temperamental, very, very temperamental. Um, also, Streamlabs has the chat overlay and the event window, so you can see what's going on and what people are saying without having to have it open in another window. Um, that's useful. There's 
all, all sorts of stuff really it just it just kind of makes it easier for you to add certain stuff to your screen and things like that um they'll they'll more than uh, likely promote all that stuff as streamlabs prime but it's not um literally everything that i've got uh, set up is just standard uh, streamlabs nothing special um can I, oh, I can rotate it mm. i'm gonna put it here so i can see it properly but uh, but yeah streamlabs is pretty good there's another one as well that i've heard of as uh, and all that might be fairly decent as well um called uh, stream elements i've not tried it but apparently that seems very similar in nature uh, it might be worth a look at as well but uh, a lot of people do just use standard old school obs uh, because it's a little bit more um stable i guess a little bit more uh streamlined it's, it won't bog your computer down quite as much um so if you've got a pretty low-end pc standard obs is probably um your best bet Of course, there's other streaming uh, services as well. Like you can use XSplit. There's that as well. There's, um, I think even Nvidia offers a streaming service now. I don't know what it's called though, um, but I think even they do it. Um, it's probably a good few out there, but probably XSplit and um, Streamlabs or Standard OBS is probably the um, the main ones. Right, okay. There we go. I'll put all my papers in there. So that's uh, the book. The, I guess, even the skin, the stories. I guess I'll put my ink materials in there as well, like my feathers. Well, that's the thing. I'll have to uh, study coal and ash. Oh, where am I going? <laughs> um, so that I can grind it. It's funny how it's a scroll shelf, but you can put anything in it. There we go. So we can make some more zombies now. Um, oh yeah, let's see what I need for fridge pallets because I want them. Oh, let's finish this uh, one off as well. It's nearly done. I don't have any ash down here, do I? Nope. Um, I could probably do over the alchemist uh, shelf as well, actually, to store all that kind of stuff. that poor corpse over there so in barming table we probably will need that eventually but uh, I could request steel parts or complex iron parts for a standard one um, the fridge pallet is complex iron parts and nails that's not too bad in a quick minute to do a hack job of a first stream Right, okay. Yeah, see, to be honest, your first your first few streams and things, I don't worry too much about them being completely perfect. Um, I mean, hell, you could even stream from your mobile or, or something, uh, and it, it'd probably still help, but obviously, the more professional, probably the better uh, kind of um, first uh, first uh, impression you probably have. So it will it will help a little bit. Um, but it's not completely necessary that you've got to have everything perfect, per se. But um, generally, just a standard little welcome screen saying that your uh, stream is starting. Um, and similar for when it's ending. Um, all that kind of stuff is fairly normal. Uh, fairly standard. Um, um, you don't, so you don't even necessarily need to have a face camera or anything. 
Um, I mean, like I say, I'm just using like a standard webcam, so that's nothing special really. Uh, but metal products. Uh, have I got? I've got one more. There we go. So as long as you've got a mic, though, and your stream's somewhat reasonably set up, it's it, it's that, it's a good start. You're off to a good start with that. Let me just um. I need to go check on the refugee camp, I think. Why oh, is this ready? This is all ready. <clears throat> I'll do it when I uh, get back. There we go. Put the uh, eight and eight, perfect. Oh, damn it, I'm short of nails. I need two more freaking nails. I'm on cooldown. Okay then. Well, I'll go replant their crops at least. Right, okay. Your food left. So we need more nails. There we go. Um, I guess it don't matter what time of day I do it. I'll, I'll rest up. Yeah, my probably my most recent streams are probably some of my better ones. Um, strangely enough, my actual uh, most watched and viewed uh, stream is actually a pretty basic one called Drive for Survival. I don't know if you've seen that on my channel. I only did a couple of episodes. Um, I actually got the game given from the dev. Um, and um, I gave it a try because it did look interesting, but it is in very early development it seems. Uh, there's not a massive amount of content there, and it's very grindy, um, which I was a little put off by. Um, but overall, it looks like a promising, decent game. Um, but for some reason, even though it's super basic and not even well known as far as I know, it, it got tremendous amounts of watch time and views. I was very surprised. Like that. that is nice. It's actually a proper ki little kitchen. Can we use it? No. Nope. Well, I hope she's happy. I think it needs to be daytime for me to speak to her. <clears throat> so we need a little bit more seeds and stuff. And we'll speak to her as well. Let's head back to the house. Um, I'll drop that random ass maggot. Oh, actually, no, I'll put the maggot actually in the farm. So we'll do the farm, go to the seed guy, um, then we'll get working on his tombstones and stuff that I've, been, that I've been meaning to do. Sands of Sa Oh, yeah, I've heard of that. Um, I haven't looked at it though, I haven't looked at it yet. What kind of gameplay is it? Early access via Steam. Fallout 4. Hmm. Yeah, I could probably request a key for the Salazar, but I've not really looked at it, so I'm not too sure what the uh, gameplay would be like. Oh yeah, I need to replant everything. Well, the hemp anyway. I'm going to sell him all my uh, excess carrots. Does he buy crop waste? Oh, damn it, I don't want all of it. Put the 
put the 80 back. I'm going to need some, but not all. Let's plant all my hemp back. these though. It's complex. You have the map locations on it to go. There's several maps to go to and there's a combat map which is dependent on which overall map you're on. Right. But is it kind of like RPG style or um, you know like with like magic and stuff or building or anything like that? Or is it just like PvP or <clears throat> Obviously, if it's got a combat map, it's probably PvP based. Yeah, I'll check it out then. I'll check your video out, why not? See what it's like, if I'm interested in maybe doing it myself. I know I do want to do another stream of my Subnautica Below Zero, because uh, that's had an update. Uh, all the voices and stuff are uh, actually voiced now. Um, at least the biggest part of them, like 95% of them apparently. And um, I've still yet to do finish building my actual base. But the likelihood is I'll probably have to restart um, anyway. But probably what I'll do is I'll use cheats or something. And I'll just do a quick playthrough, building a base up. Uh, getting vehicles, that kind of thing, and exploring what's new. So I'll probably just do maybe one or two streams on that. Final Fantasy base, that, that actually, that probably is for me then. So he doesn't buy crop waste, they don't buy hemp, but he will buy carrots. So I'll sell him them anyway. Let's have a look. So I need a beets, I need onion. And pumpkin. Um, shall I get some of these? See, I could have them growing them, you see. I guess I'll get another ten of each again, just to keep it cheap. But once I've got enough, I'll probably... Oh, they've already got enough of them, haven't I? Uh, I'll get some for myself anyway. Sod it. But once um, once they've got enough, I'll probably be able to get them to farm a lot of stuff for me. Yeah, if it's anything like Final Fantasy, then uh, it'll probably be something I'll be quite interested in. But yeah, I'm probably going to do one or two streams on Subnautica pretty soon. Um, I'm just trying to think if there's any other stuff that I want that I'm currently uh, got in the works. Average wheat, beets, onions, pumpkin. I guess the crop waste can stay here for now. Uh, I need the peat. Okay. So I've got 26 wheat, so I could grow that. Um, there we go, 26 beets. I'll take that. You know, what, I'm going to take that wheat as well. I don't think I don't know if they can cook with it though. Um, in fact, I'll leave it for now. I'll leave the wheat here. We've almost got enough carrot seed, but not quite. I'll do. That's the four I've got. I think I need more planks. So it'll be another two of them easy. And six nails. I don't think I need any more. Uh, that makes them anyway. Back 
to the refugee camp. Dynasty Warriors, yeah, I love Dynasty Warriors. I think if they made a proper RPG style, maybe even an MMO style Dynasty Warriors game, I would be all up for that. I'd be straight on there. Uh, where's this woman? There she is. I improved your kitchen. Hope it's a little closer now to your ideal. Definitely my keeper, you're such a wonder, but there's one thing that's interfering with my complete happiness. There's nothing I, I have which makes our hard life a little bit sweeter. So honey she's talking about. I recommend honey for that, and I could even build some hives for you. Oh yeah, we still not build ours yet. Oh amazing, if you do that I, I, I'll share some of my culinary secrets with you. Sounds cool. Yeah, so we'll probably have to get on with building hives, both for her and us. Right, let's replant their cabbage and plant beet as well. <clears throat> It'll give them a little bit of a selection. But I'm not sure if they can do anything with wheat. They can obviously grow it, but I don't know if they can do anything with it. Well, they're well fed anyway. Got quite a few empty tents by the looks of it, maybe. Yeah, so which, which was the latest one I played? I think it was Dynasty Warriors 8. I don't know if there's any others since then. Um, but I, I actually kind of like the... Um, oh, there you go, look at your bees. We'll have to buy them up the beekeeper though, I think. Or can you get, or can you get bees yourself? I can't remember. Not sure. Beats. Oh, let me put them in the tent. Beat seeds. But yeah, I played uh, Dynasty Warriors 8, the most recent, but that was a good while ago. Let's uh, let's go make that hemp rope. Just use the hemp up. And then obviously I'll, I better work on my graves and then the beehives. But we've got plenty of zombie juice so any um, um, thing is um, zombies or corpses that we want to turn into zombies will be uh, easy to do once we've got a bit more faith. I'll probably have to work on the Eva Combo prayer or uh, prayer for faith pretty soon though. Now let's have a look. Oh, I don't have enough flitch. So I'm definitely going to want more of these. And then we'll get fridge pallets on the go. And then I can start spending days just doing this. Not going to have enough energy to finish this one off, but that's fine. There we go. Yeah, I've got to upgrade that kind of stuff as well. See, so I do just want—I do want to get more zombies and stuff. But to be honest, I think we're probably gonna have to do. Oh, I didn't drop that off. Uh, oh yeah, never mind. No matter. Um, obviously, we do need to upgrade the church to get more faith. So. Right, so we need more complex parts. Um, yeah, that'll be enough for two fridge pallets. I 
and we're going to need more flitch as well. See, I need I need stone, so I want zombies for the stone, really, so I don't have to do it. Actually, bridge pallet. Um, shall I build it down there? Or shall I put it where I can see it? I'll put it here. I'll put them all along here. <clears throat> can I get? Hmm. I can do it that way. So it'll fit properly. I can't remember how I did it last time. I ended up with a bunch of them, um, probably like that, so there's a line in the middle, and then I built something else here as well, I can't remember what it was. Um, hmm. So I think I put like equipment supplies up here or something. It's right, I'm just going to pop, pop it all the way down the bottom, I think, but probably this way. So I can do two rows of them. Is it there or there? There. <coughs> Damn it, I don't have enough nails. I knew it. That's why I made those extra nails, but obviously still haven't got enough. Oh, there we go, we can have a few more bodies anyway. See what else can we build? Can we build? So we've got the abami table. I'd rather build the second itineration of that, and the mortuary rack requires for two beams, so we can start storing all this stuff in that. Uh, oh, that's it. Time to go burn. What he chucked it for. I don't know if I'll have enough energy to build one. Yep, just about. Come on. Nice and toasty. There we go. Yeah, I want to get the uh, the zombie quarry up and running. Where possible. I need to research that so I can make the black paint. Um, I'm researching it now actually, so I know. Oh yeah, I need a rest first though. See, I've not really need my, needed my blue points for anything else, so yeah, I'll probably get the confessional and the church shrine. But definitely, we'll get that. Um, so there's incense or softness. I think you need silks and stuff for that, though, don't you? Stained glass windows, that's for the upgraded church. So we don't really need that yet. The graveyard enhancements. Um, let's get the soft stuff and uh, we'll see what stuff we need. I'm pretty sure you need silk. I don't I, I don't think we can make silk. I don't think, but obviously we can start buying it and stockpiling it 
from the merchant if that's the case. Drop this stuff off. Um, oh, I didn't leave any coal down here. I thought I did. Let me just go grab some coal. I'm not sure which one I can use to make the black paint. Take a little bit more of the ash as well. I've got plenty of paper, that's not a problem. Coal. That's two. Okay. Apparently, coal can't really decompose into anything. So that's definitely not it. So it's definitely ash. Don't say what it goes into, though. Just says complete. Crafted at the alchemy mill, apparently. And the zombie mine. Hmm. We, uh. Can I, so I can't even mill it. No. Oh. What? So, what do we use for black paint? I'm gonna have to wiki it out. Um, <clears throat> let's have a look. So the chapters. So ink is made of black paint, conical flask and water. And then what's the black paint made out of? Graphite powder, ash and oil, death powder. So what do we need to make? I know where the graphite is. So oil is made by seed oil and fat. So the fat can be done in the vine press. Okay, well we don't have the vine press yet. Um, the death powder's dark intestines, so I don't have that. Uh, what else? The graphite powder. And that's obviously graphite in the alchemy mill. I don't know if I've got any graphite actually. Probably not. So, I don't know, what was it? Ash, ash and oil? Yeah, so we can't do the ash and oil. Because we can't make the oil yet. I think it's here that we make vine stuff anyway. The vine press and whatnot. The rest of this can go back in there. Um. I've got a graphite in here. No, I don't. What did I do with it? I did something with it. I know where to get it though. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. I'll worry about that later. Um, so, we need to check what the pews need for upgrading. Um, and then, mm, yeah, let's, let's just go straight there. Have a see, see what we need. It's actually merchant day anyway, so we can always go get 
We can always go and get some. And then when the next set of corpses come, if the decent corpses will, uh, hopefully we want two more zombies at least. Um, so that we can um, get the stone mine up and running. So confessionals complex iron parts. So we need we're gonna need some more. We can build one, but we're gonna need more. So it's twelve and four. The soft church bench, yeah, silk and jointing. So we're either gonna have to buy the jointing, or we're gonna have to unlock the next stage of woodworking. But I guess for the time being, we will build at least one confessional because we can get stories from that as well. I want to take confession. Right, so we need 12 and 4 planks and stuff. Um, let's just teleport actually. I'm lazy. So we need more complex iron parts. This another 4. And we need 12 planks. Um, yeah, it's great. It uses more logs doing it this way, but it's fine. I need more energy, really. <clears throat> I guess I'll just go speak to the uh, merchant. Um, even though I've got no energy. Oh, it's not there. Is it not that day? Oh no, I think it's Pitchfork, isn't it? Uh, yeah. It's the Inquisitor's day today. Well, damn. Um, no, there's not what I can really do. Um, I guess I'll walk back and visit the Seed Man on the way. Oh, there's his next corpse. Come on, Slowpoke. You're in my way. Thank you. Right, so... More onion. Uh, more pumpkin. I'll get the extra beets as well. I want more car uh, carrots and stuff as well. Because eventually they can grow that. Um, that should do actually. Yeah. Let's teleport home. Since we're nice and lazy. <laughs> So we should have enough seeds now for most of the stuff. Right, let's um, start this and wait for Donkey to show up. There he is. I won't be able to work on the corpse, but I can put it on the fridge pallet. At least. I don't think it completely stops them from decaying, but um, it'll definitely extend the amount of life. Oh, if it get worse, it'll be one or two percent decay. Oh, 
planks. Right, let's make my uh, last set of planks while I'm here so I can uh, make the other confessional. See what the decay is. Nothing. Wow. Okay. So did it did it stop it decaying? Oh, it's at ninety nine percent. Maybe because I just chucked it on the floor. Who knows? Anyway, it's not going to be the best one. It'll be a five skull. But that's fine. I'll still make a zombie out of it. Why not? There's nothing really wrong with a five skull. The different. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I don't have enough prayer. Enough faith. Okay, I guess I'm burying this guy. <clears throat> um. Yeah, down here. So I need to move that one, really. So I can put my grass in there. I'm not doing that yet anyway, it don't matter. What, what kind of... Oh, it's actually a pretty decent one as well. I'll probably just have to exhume him and put it, uh, bury him again at the side. How much is an exhumation scroll? Is it, I think it's about the same as a, uh, a burial certificate, isn't it? A burial certificate's one silver fifty. Uh, where did that barrel certificate go? I literally just picked one up, didn't I? Oh, it's there. Yeah, I think it's one silver fifty. Oh, 175. So it costs you 25 bronze uh, or copper to dig a body up. I have actually got one certificate already. 30. Oh, I can actually get the royal stamp. Oh, it's 50 silver, though. Mm, I don't have enough yet. I can get building permission though. Man, he wants he wants um what's it from me though? Uh like what was it? Firewood and flyers and things like that to prove my loyalty first, as it were. If I remember correctly. Ooh, story. Ooh, and a fifth. Sweet. Uh, confessional. There we go. There we go. The church can be upgraded as well now. <coughs> Shelf. So we have got a good bit of stories. Um, we just need the black ink, which is graphite. So I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna go find out about graphite. So I know it's up near the quarry. Over here. What, see, what do we need for the uh, the zombie stuff as well? Is it here? There. So we need pickaxes. It's actually pretty cheap. So zombie are oh, mine left and right. I, I know that's. I, I think that's definitely iron though, and that's that's obviously stone and that's marble. So we'll have to make some more pickaxes as well. But yeah, I'm pretty sure this one here is graphite. Oh, maybe not. It looks like iron. So where's the graphite one? I'm sure I got graphite from something like that. Um, let me check on here, it should tell me where graphite is. 
I know it's from one of those. I, I have I have picked some graphite up before. In able to craft it, you need to unlock the precious metals in the building tree. Oh, it's using the you, you get it as a byproduct of uh, oh, it's using the production of steel ingots. In order to craft graphite, you'll need the advanced smelting and precious metals technology. So it's made in the forge. Right. Interesting. I knew I'd seen it somewhere. Let's have a look. So it's in the furnace. Is it? No. See, it's used. It's used to make steel. I thought it were made here. Um, hmm. Oh, you've got to be able to craft it though. Yeah, but using special, special metals, smelting. Where is it? Is it, is it not on the smelting? Maybe on the like nature. No. Building. Yeah, graphite. It's there. Have I got enough points? I have. So we can get gold or silver. Or. So where do you get? <coughs> where do you actually get them? It's probably that mine draft uh, that I just got the um, the iron from. Randomly, I think. So we can actually make graphite now. So what do we make graphite from? Coal. Yeah. Well, that's fine then. So let's. Um, I'll get some of that going because we've got plenty of coal. Uh, it's 50 seconds of time. Uh, yeah, let's have 10, 10 on the go. Right, so we need some more pickaxes. At least two, possibly, to start with. Can we make better stuff now? No, we can't. Not yet. Upgrade to anvil two, so we need some steel. So once that's done, um, my shovel's nearly done for. Might as well fix that while I'm here. There we go. Right, so let's make some. Uh, oh, I can't make some stone stuff. I've got no stone. Let's just rest, I guess. I'll go check on the refugee camp as well. Oh, well, there's a new corpse. Let's not let it decay too much. I'll uh, wake up a bit early. Two graphite. I'll have to study that. Unless you can just blindly do it. Throw that one on the body, to, uh, on the floor, so that I uh, know it's a shit one. <laughs> um, yeah. Let's go. Let's go see if I can use graphite as it is, or if I have got to study it first. I think I've got to study it first. I'm pretty sure it's the alchemy mill. Yeah. I might have enough faith to study it. Yes, just. Wow. There we go. Decompose into powder. There we are. Make some black paint. Graphite powder. So what is it? It's graphite powder and water. I don't think I've got any water down here though, have I? <clears throat> I'll make a couple. There 
This is why I need the alchemy shelf as well. I think for the time being I'll just shove it in here. It's going to be for paper and ink, for ink, pen and ink anyway. Um, no, so I'll have to go get some water. <clears throat> and then we'll have to rest. Ready for prayers and the bishop. Where's the graphic? What there is. Ta da! Finally. Um, I'll just leave it for now. I only need one to start with. Do so you make it here or on here? There, ink. Do you get five a time? Jesus Christ, that's good actually then. It's actually really cheap. And then pen and ink. You get through here time with that as well. Perfect. Wow. I didn't realise it was actually that cheap. But now we can start making notes. So unfortunately we've only got bronze, so that's only a 20% chance, but we need industriousness, playwright, and writer. Okay then. Yeah, very, very, very little chance of getting a uh, silver and upwards. But oh well. A note is worth double, so it's not brilliant, but it's better than nothing. So industrious, playwright and writer. At the very least I'll be able to make um, a bronze uh, prayer for faith or a combo prayer. Let's make a chapter. 10% chance. Wow. That is brutal. Uh. You actually get blue points from that as well, that's good. Oh yeah, we need the flyers. Not yet, we don't though, that's fine. Um, put the chapter there for now. Let's uh, go do a ceremony. Before I forget, because it's nearly night time. Yes. <laughs> nearly missed it. Look at all these people. A lot more people. Nice. Oop, even picked one up, so that's five. <clears throat> that's a two. So we've got seven. That's awesome. Sorry. And one more faith. Nice. Uh, 
We're definitely starting to get somewhere now on the faith points and stuff. Um, it's a hell of a lot better. Oh yeah, I'll put my chapter in this shelf as well. Why not? But yeah, we'll be able to make um, prayer for faith. It's 10 energy though, which I don't think I've got right now. But we can only make a bronze one, unfortunately. But yeah, and then eventually we want the combo prayer. I don't think I've got that unlocked though by the looks of it. What do we need there? Oh, red wine. Let's see if I've got enough energy to do it now. Oh, it's instant. Wow, okay. If I'd have known that, I would have made it first. Oh man, you're saying that, I wouldn't have had enough faith. So that'll give us 50% more faith. Uh, and a little bit of extra money as well. That effect is faith times two though. That one's faith times one. So, mm, yeah, I think that'll be still be better overall, though. But we'll find out next time. Um, on the next sermon, as it were. Okay, let's get some rest. So when it comes to Pitchfork Day, we want to go buy out his, all his silk. I think it's... Uh, it, how much did he sell at once? I can't remember. I know we can get at least two anyway. I think he sold like maybe what, like ten a time or something. If we've got the money, we might, might as well get it all. As much as we can anyway. Right, so we need some steel. Upgrade that. Then we might get some slightly better stuff as well, maybe. Uh, looks like we need more complex parts. Just one more. Also, I've got maybe some more nails. Gonna need. I don't think there's anything else we currently need, is there? I've actually got some beams and lots of planks. I wish I knew that. <coughs> what did I need up there? Set my planks and my beams up there. We'll go to the refugee camp. Let's see how it's going. Seven point, just about seven point five ish. There she is. Let's. Uh... Oh, she wants the hives, don't she? I forgot. Oh, we can trade with her. Simple snacks, in lentil we trust. Vegetable set and milk processing. Okay. Cabbage. And damn it, I need more beet seeds. I didn't get enough beet back. That's annoying. So I need more beet seeds again. Yeah. Ooh, they nearly ran out. Look at all these random mushrooms and stuff they're getting. I think it's because they're eating this stuff first. Possibly. <clears throat> uh, let's make the last bed and probably get a new person as well. Yeah. And another new person. We've got enough for another one. No, we aren't. But we've now got seven people in the village though. So we've got another quest. Ooh, Bertani, Tobasa, Bertani, 
Barupa Irtaistri. They must fit new people. Well, getting paid to do something good is always better than getting paid to do something bad. Yeah. A witch's eye, porcelain pitcher, money, jewelry. What the hell is a witch's eye for? Oh, that's for the. Uh, eh? No, actually, no, I don't know. The witch's eye. Okay, camp. Offer to build an automatic well. So he said he didn't have any tasks for us, but there you go. So build an automatic well. What else can we talk to him about? That's really it, isn't it? Uh... Yeah, okay then. So we probably so we can probably build two more tents in total. Yeah, I know there's a, sw uh, a witch in the swamp. But what what about the witch? I know I need to get hiccup grass and things like that from her. Uh, for the birch shed. Um, what's the point in the in the bed thing now? I can't build anymore. Unless you can build them here. <clears throat> There's a water well too. It's just refugee happiness. Delivers its bearer visions of the past. Cranky. Only works when it wants to. Okay. Interesting. Literally, it apparently I don't have to build it. Oh, yeah, because it goes there, doesn't it? Yeah, so the zombie quarry on the right is the same thing. I just need more flitch. Um, oh, I need to build the portal station here, so we need flitch and some paper. Okay, then. There's my steel. 30 energy, Jesus Christ. Oh well. Uh, what have we unlocked? I think it just costs slightly less energy, maybe. Ooh, we can make the upgraded axes and stuff, though. Obviously, with the steel. An iron hammer made out of steel. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Uh, but that's about it though. So we can make upgraded shovels and axes and things and yeah. So I'll get on to that next time probably. I don't know what the porcelain pictures are before. I'll make the rest of the steel ready. Oh, I've not got enough fuel. Okay, let's add fuel first then. The beehive area. I 
What, do you mean she's got beehives as well that you can get? Let's make this six. So the beehive area is literally just up here. But yeah, thanks for reminding me, I do need to get that done as well. Simple iron parts and clean paper. And then the hives themselves. Oh, there's loads of berries up here. Nope, not the tree. Oh, that's what you mean, yeah. It's not the witch's eye, though, it's witch's eye. But, yeah. Apparently you get v visions from it, but I don't know. Maybe it is to do... It, oh, I mean, it's to do with the, uh, the witch. So from the beehive area and then that way. Okay. I mean, there's a house here. Maybe it's going to show us that. Oh no, it's not. This is there at the left. <clears throat> but you mean over by the swamp area. We'll go and have a look. There's this bit here. Is the swamp area. See the witch. There's some iron there. The witch is over here. Oh yeah, I forgot I didn't build the bridge. Because I didn't have the stuff on me. Hmm. No idea, I'll look into it. I'm gonna uh, head back to the house and I'll be ending my stream there, I think. Um, so, yeah, we've got, we've got a good bit of stuff to do then, really, in the next stream. We'll probably continue to upgrade the refugee camp as we can. Um, whether there's quests for it or not. I know we can build the beehives for that woman, um, the automatic well, that kind of stuff, so we've still got a little bit to do. Um, I'll we'll continue to finish off making a zombies to automate... Oh, damn it, I didn't mean to get in bed. Um, continue to uh, make zombies to automate our, our production lines, as it were. Um, and then we will probably also then take a look at doing that um, the vampire story because I've not even followed that at all. Uh, I've talked to a couple of people and that's it. And then um, we've also got the tavern as well to have a look at. I think what we have to do for the tavern, if I remember correctly, is that red wine that we've got to feed to Jerry. I think we've got to give him that. And then I think then he asks for proper beer. And then I think he talks about actually making our own beer, uh, including the tavern. If I remember correctly, um, so we'll probably follow that that kind of quest line as well. So yeah, we've still got loads of stuff to do. We've got we've got the vampire download content thing, whatever that's about. We've got more zombies. We've got um, the tavern. So that'll show a lot of history. That one um, and just generally updating our. Oh, I forgot to talk to the bishop. Oh well, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Um, yes, we've got all greatest church and everything and every, all that kind of stuff as well. So yeah, loads to do. So um, yeah, thank you for stopping by there, Mighty Pancake. Um, 
So it's, it's nice to have uh, a bit of discussion uh, about somebody who uh, loves the game as well. Um, and thanks to everybody else who has uh, all the new subscribers and those that have liked the uh, the video. So um, yeah, thank you everybody, and hopefully I will see you next time then for all the uh, all the uh, new and exciting stuff that we will be uh, having a look into. So uh, yeah, thank you, and I will see you next time.